Apple DJ Mac with the Apple DJ Mac Super Bass Rack for Ableton Live. All those synth sounds were made with this particular rack. And let me share those with you right now. Okay, so I had been asked if I could make a bass rack, something really thick. Um, and this is what I've come up with for you. Um, it's made with the analog synth here. Um, nice thing that kind of happened here was trying to make it just a bass sound. I found out that it works well to, for some chords and also like a nice high lead sound. So let me show you how this thing works. From We'll start with the bass sound here. So um, analog is pretty cool. It's got a pretty thick sound, I think. And um, great filters. So I racked up these filters. Nice resonance there. Um, I've made the LFO mapped out to your filter frequency. I also mapped the rate to a knob here for you. And also the shape of the LFO. Goes from sine to triangle to square rectangle to noise one and noise two. Okay, so nice and some good options there for that. Um, if you really want to fatten this thing up, I've made this little effect rack here. This is an amplifier effect rack. Basically, I'm taking your signal and I'm I'm uh, <laughs> splitting it up into the high frequencies and the low frequencies. Um, the high ones go through this EQ here and then to the amp effect while the low ones go through an EQ into nothing so they stay clean. So the effect here is really dirty this up. Turn this knob up. Get almost like a fuzzed out bass guitar sound. Kind of fun, I think. Um, next, I put some delay on here. And also some chorus. Kind of spreads it out a bit. So, as I said before, I think this thing is kind of nice for um, some different sounds here. So, um, just to give you an example, I made this little kind of chord progression here. So I'll start you off. This chord sound is really functioning off the LFO a lot, going through the noise shape. It's giving you these kind of like rhythmic eighth note choppy sounds. Of course, you could play with the frequency on it. Kind of cool sound. Uh, I've also made this uh, lead sound to take out those chords. You can see I did a little EQing at the end of this. Um, but this one too, a couple changes I made here is I turned on the glide and made it monophonic right here. Monophonic. And then turned the glide on here to give it a nice stretch between notes. And a little drum beat to go along with it. Crazy little drum beat. And there's everything for you. 
all mixed together. All those sounds are made from the same synth. Hope you enjoy.